I'm kind of nervous, not gonna lie. Technically, we on a date together. Something ain't adding up. welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Tatiana and as you can tell by the title today I will be going on a solo date I know that I want to go get some flowers and I want to try this new boba shop and I also want to get some ramen I'm kind of nervous not gonna lie because this will be my first time that I'm doing something like this but I think that it's important to you know treat yourself and take yourself out sometimes and it's always good to spend time by yourself and just do nice things for yourself you don't always need to go out with somebody else so yeah i'm gonna see you all when i get there well i'm gonna see you all when i get to the first place Y'all, it's raining so bad, but these are the flowers that I end up getting. I know it's barely any flowers, but look, they still cute. And that's all that matters, okay? This all they had for real that I liked, so that's what I got. can't put it away. Mm-hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about. Like to get it, pop me with these bitches and my business got me 
Y'all, yeah, I picked just about the worst day ever to come outside and to do this. It's pouring down, raining. It's cold. I should have did this yesterday, but I didn't feel like it. I was too tired. So I'm thinking, yeah, I'll just do it tomorrow. That's fine. No. It's pouring down. It's just, it's really a mess out here. But I'm pretty much done now. I done did basically everything I wanted to do. And, um, yeah, I, um, I feel like the person next to me is staring at me, but I don't want to look to find out. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna drive somewhere else and then I'm gonna talk to y'all. I look crazy as hell with this hood on, too. All right. Okay, y'all. Um, hold on. Let me fix. Let me fix my hair. My hair looking crazy. The rain ain't making no better. I'm finna uh, put on my trusty dusty hat <laughs> that I know y'all probably tired of seeing. But yeah, perfect. Um, I just want to talk to y'all real quick while I'm in the car because I don't know. I feel like once I go home, the day over with. So yeah, but I just left out the restaurant and I moved my car because it was too many people by me. And um, I don't like talking when I feel like people staring at me. But I just left out the restaurant and. I had ate some spicy miso. It was so good. And then I ended up getting some boba out of there instead of going to the other boba place because I guess they just started selling boba. I didn't even know that they um started selling boba. Well, I didn't even know that they sold boba. So I got it out of there. I got like a dessert can because I don't really like boba. Oh, well, I do a little bit, but I don't like when it's too much boba, like when it's more of the tapioca than it is the drink like you just eating at that point like you're not even drinking but i had got this i got this oreo brulee boba i don't really know what's in it because it don't say but it tastes chocolatey and he got tapioca pearls in it and then i think he got like chopped up oreos and i don't know what else i guess like milk tea i don't know it's good though it tastes a little, a little strong. I don't know what that is that's making it, making it taste like that, but yeah. But yeah, I, I said it already. I think that I, am, I didn't talk enough because they was playing music, so there was no point because y'all gonna have to cut it out and all that. Plus, it would have kind of been awkward talking to y'all or talking to a camera. I have to eat by myself. But I know some people do it, but this is my first solo date, so, you know, I'm going to be a little shy, a little scared. But I think everything turned out cool so far. Like, I ate, I got my flowers, got my boba. I basically did everything that I wanted to do. And it was actually a, a fun experience. Like, ain't nobody bothered me or anything. So, yeah, feel kind of peaceful. I usually though I like doing stuff by myself, but I never really like went out to eat and all that by myself. But like running errands and stuff, I, I like doing stuff by myself. Yeah, there's some other stuff in here. I don't know. I really hope that don't nobody try to come 
parked by me because there's all these empty parks in this parking lot and I came over here specifically to get away from people. So if they do, I'm gonna be very mad. If they do, I'm gonna be very mad. I'm not gonna lie. But um, I wanna try to see if I can get an angle where my steering wheel not in it because that's gonna irritate me when I'm editing. I'm already knowing. I got a tripod. I always bring my tripod everywhere I go, but I'll never use it. I don't know why. I just don't. But hold on, let me see what I can do. I can do this. Maybe I'll do this. This might be a little, a little better. Child, real close to me, y'all, all in my face. All in my face. Let me scoot back some. Cause this this working shit. I like it. <laughs> Since I'm on a solo date, but I brought y'all with me, technically we on a date together. So I wanted to, well, in the, in the spirit of going on dates, I wanted to um, tell y'all a little bit about myself because I know that one day I just picked up a camera and just started vlogging. I never really introduced myself. I never told y'all anything about me for real. And the only reason why I did that is because Yeah, the only reason why I did that is because um, I when I first started, I didn't really have no subscribers. So I feel like it was no point of introducing myself because nobody, like nobody was gonna see it. So I was just gonna wait until I got enough subscribers to do it. I still don't have a lot of subscribers, but I feel like now is a, as good as time as any to introduce myself. Cause you know why would people want to watch you if they don't even know anything about you they don't even know who you is so yeah so let me see oh damn i had wrote down some questions on my phone but i'm filming on my phone so let me see if it pop up on my other phone real quick okay I got the questions so um well let me let me introduce myself so my name is tatiana or jordan you call me tatiana or jordan it really don't matter they both my names you call me tatiana you call me jordan you call me tatiana jordan you can call me it girl tati it don't it don't matter all of that is they all my names it don't matter but i would prefer to be called tatiana my name is Tatiana and I'm 24 years old. I just turned 24 this July. My birthday is July 15th. I'm a Cancer. And my favorite color is blue. Preferably either turquoise or teal. I still haven't decided yet, but yeah, I like blue. I hope y'all can hear me because it's running really loud. And if I go and edit this and y'all can't, and you can't really hear me, I'm gonna be so mad. But yeah, um, let's see, let's see what else I get. The question is, are you an introvert or an extrovert? I hope I'm saying that right. I am an introvert. I don't really talk much. If you watch any other, if you watch any of my other vlogs, you could probably tell because I barely talk in my vlogs which is that's something i want to get better at um talking more in my vlogs because i feel like my vlogs are like more short or less interesting because i don't talk as much but honestly it really it really don't be nothing to say but yeah i am an introvert um but like if i know you obviously i'll probably very talkative and yeah i just don't have nothing to say but I'm still, I'm a very nice person. Yeah. And, um, what else? Oh, I'm from Chicago, born and raised. I'm from the South Side. That's very important. <laughs> um, what else, what else, what else? My hobbies. My hobbies are cooking and now YouTube. So, yeah. 
So, actually, I used to have, well, I still have it. I had a cooking channel on YouTube before I started my blog channel. So, if you want to subscribe to that, I'll put my, I'll put the link in the description. And I might even put the, um, the link on the screen. But, yeah. I really love cooking. I always, I've always been cooking, like, even since I was a kid. I went to culinary school. I graduated. I'm really, I'm really certified out here. I don't cook as much as I would like to, but I really, I really love to cook. So, um, yeah. Eventually, I do want to start back posting on my cooking page. I just stopped for a while because, I don't know, it's complicated. But, as you know, so I'm going to tell y'all, I liked cooking, but I just didn't like the way that I was, like, doing it. Because I was doing, like, tasty style videos. Like, I was doing, I was really, I wasn't talking and none of that. Like, I was just recording my hands and me cooking and all that. And, I don't know, I just wanted to switch it up. I do think in the future that I'll probably start back posting on that page and I might even cook a little more on this page. I want to like do, you know, like real, like a little cooking channel type of thing, like where you can actually see me cook and I talk and all that. Just like having fun in the kitchen, stuff like that. So, um, yeah, my hobbies are cooking and filming YouTube videos. The question is, are you a homebody or are you outgoing? Whatever. I say that I'm a homebody. Like, I love being at home, relaxing, chilling, being in my own space. So, yeah. But when I do go out, it's, <laughs> when I do go out, it's, it's a vibe. I feel like it's a vibe. I love... I like being in the house like most days, but like if it's something like a trip or like a event or like going out to eat, I'll be there. Cause yeah, that's one thing about me. I love cooking and I love to eat. So if it's food involved, I'm there. I would say I'm just naturally a homebody. Like it ain't nothing I gotta force. It's just me. It's just in me. <laughs> It's just in me for real. Next question. Next question. Shit, I ain't got that many questions. One of the questions was how tall I am. I don't know if y'all even care how tall I am, but I'm not that tall. I'm 5'1". Like, well, actually, well, yeah, I'm 5'1". And then, like, my mom and my sister, we're all the same height. Well, technically, I mean, well, kind of, because they're five feet, and then I'm five one, so they always be, like, trying to make it a big deal that I'm taller than them when it really don't matter, for real. <laughs> they be like, oh, you taller, you can reach this, do this, do that. We're, we're basically the same height, like, relax. When I first meet people, I like telling them that I'm five one or five two on a good day. That just, like, my little, my little joke. But, yeah. Even though I'm short, though, I love wearing, like, platform shoes. Like, I don't know why. I don't even, like, I don't care that I'm short. I don't even make it a mission to, like, try to be or appear taller. Because I feel like five, like, five one is, like, average height to me. So, it's, it's not like I'm extra short. So I really don't care, but I just love platforms. I just like had look. What else can I tell y'all? Oh, uh, my favorite season. My favorite season is either spring or fall. I like those seasons because they're like milder seasons. It's not too hot, not too cold. The only thing that I don't like about spring is that it rains a lot. I know it's necessary, but it's just, I don't like that part. But I like the mild weather. But, um, I'm a summer baby, so I would rather be hot than cold. But I don't want to be too hot, you know? Like a, I like a cool middle ground. 
Um, the question is, do I have any tattoos or piercings? I have... I have both. I'm about to count real quick to see. I got, I got my nose pierced. I got both my uh, earlobes pierced twice. So that's four. That's five piercings, right? One, two, three, four, five. And then I got my industrial pierced. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's like seven piercings. It depends on how you count it. But yeah, I got my nose pierced. I got both my earlobes pierced twice. And then I got an industrial piercing. And then tattoo-wise, I got a lot of tattoos. And I barely be remembering how many tattoos I got. But I want to say I got at least 10. But again, I'm going to count and I'm going to see. I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Six, seven, eight. Okay, well, something ain't adding up. Because I thought I had ten tattoos, but when I just counted, I got eight. So let, let's do that one. Let's do that one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six. seven eight all right y'all i got i got eight tattoos i don't need, see i got so many tattoos that's eight not even a lot of tattoos for real but i got tattoos that i can't even remember what tattoos i got i ain't got a tattoo in a while honestly my last tattoo that i got was the biggest and the most expensive tattoo which was my medusa tattoo on my arm right here if you watch any of my other videos you probably would have seen it but yeah, that's the last tattoo I got. I after that tattoo, I just haven't found anything else that I wanted, so I haven't got any more. But I do plan on in the future either getting some, getting some cover ups or getting some of my tattoos like reworked or fixed. Cause it's a lot of tattoos I got when I first started getting tattoos. I don't really like them anymore, or I don't like the quality of them because I got my tattoos done by like a lot of different people. So the quality of them are different and they don't really match up in my opinion. I feel like some look real good and some just look like cheap. You know, you get, you get what you pay for. My tattoos weren't cheap, but in my opinion, they look cheap compared to my more expensive ones. So yeah. I probably do a vlog about that, but that's not gonna be for a while. I honestly haven't been wanting no tattoos no time soon. I just haven't found nothing that I like. So when I do find something that I like, y'all gonna know because I'm gonna show y'all. Um this video gonna be so long, but I don't care. I I need long videos. I'm let's see what else I can tell y'all. Um know what my favorite food is um honestly i would say my favorite food is i can't really tell what my favorite food is but i love like brunch and stuff so i would say i love french toast i would say that french toast is my favorite food because that's all i can think of right now but yeah i have to say that french toast is my favorite food um, my mouth dry. This big, I'm gonna be drinking this forever. It's barely gone, it's like right here. I don't know why I got this big thing. But if I don't finish it, it's going right in the refrigerator when I get home. <laughs> I'm kind of glad that it's raining because my windows fogged up. So I don't got to blur my background. I probably wouldn't do it anyway because I'm in a random park a lot. So it don't matter. Keep backing off for the last question, which was what's my favorite food? I think my favorite restaurant, well, one of my favorite restaurants is Chipotle. 
I love Chipotle. Like, I can eat Chipotle every day. Just last week, I ate Chipotle twice. Back to back. But... <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I've been eating Chipotle since I was a kid and it fell off a little bit. But I still continue to go. I don't know. Something about Chipotle is just addicting. But that's it. This is not no Chipotle video. So let me start talking about them. My favorite type of videos to watch on YouTube are hauls and vlogs. So that's basically what I do too. Hauls and vlogs. Oh, Oh, I want to tell y'all why I even got into vlogging in the first place. Because, I don't know. Doing something like this, like vlogging and recording in public, that's really stepping out of my comfort zone for me. Because, I'm, like I told y'all, I'm introverted, I'm shy. I don't really do stuff like this. So, I don't know. I just randomly one day, I was thinking, and I'm like, yeah, I should, I should start vlogging because... Me and my boyfriend, we had a lot of stuff planned for the summer. Like, we had, like, I don't know how many. We had, like, four or five concerts back-to-back -back coming up. Like, yeah, people people need to see this. Because <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, this year has been, like, the most eventful year or, like, the most eventful summer that I had in my whole entire life. Like, I was doing so much. I was going on trips, concert after concert going out left and right like damn i make it sound like my life boring it's it's not though it's not boring but i don't know this is just the most eventful but like a few years ago it i'm exaggerating but my life is eventful it's just like it's a few years ago or a few months ago i wouldn't have even thought to pick up a camera and start vlogging like i just started doing it and i feel like i'm getting better at it the more that i do it i just want to um i don't know i just want to continue to learn and grow with this learn how, learn more editing techniques just just learn more stuff okay it's always it's always something to learn it's always more to learn don't ever think that you done learning okay so yeah um i really don't know what else to say to y'all but if i think of something else i'll come back i'm gonna sit here for a while drink my drink in the end i'm probably gonna go home so yeah we we gonna see we gonna see i'm gonna look up some questions though so I don't, want, I don't want this video to be short. Because if this video is short, I feel like I do all this for nothing. You know? So, I'll see y'all in a few minutes. Y'all, um, somebody parked next to me. And I was mad. At, but she was being nice to me. And she said that she liked my sticker on my car. I got a Sailor Moon sticker on the back of my car. Well, I got one on the side of my car too, but it's messed up. But she was like, oh, I like your sticker, da da da. And then I felt bad because I was talking shit. But I don't know if she could hear me talking shit. So if not, that's good. But that brings me to my next point because I ain't know what else to say. But I like anime. One of my, I want one of my favorite animes to watch is Sailor Moon. Well, I I really I finished it for real. But, yeah, I like Sailor Moon. That's one of my favorites. I got Sailor Moon stickers and stuff all over my car. A lot of Sailor Moon merch. All that. But really, though, I need to get home because it's cold. And I'm just out here now. Like, I'm just wasting time. I'm probably going to watch a movie when I get home. I want to watch The Little Mermaid because it's on. They finally put it on Disney Plus, And I still haven't seen it. I wanted to go to the movies to see it, but I never got around to doing it. So now that it's on Disney Plus, I can finally watch it. So um yeah. Um see y'all when I get home. Oh, it's really time to go for real because I didn't why I didn't ran out of space. 
I'm just in here yappy yappy yappy. I ran out of space. I went on my window to defrost, but I wanted to say that I think that this solo date was very successful and I would definitely do something like this again. I don't know when or what I'm gonna do next, but yeah, it was fun. It, well, it was cool. Like it was a nice little thing to do and I'll do it again. So yeah, I need to hurry. I'm ready to go. I've been here too long now. I'm back home now. As you can see, I'm about to put my flowers in my vase. Low key, I was thinking about it, and I'm like, three flowers for eight dollars is crazy. Like, you used to be able to get a whole dozen for that price, but that's crazy. Inflation is really something else i was gonna use my blue vase that i usually use but i found this pink vase so i think i'm gonna use that one instead because the flowers are pink the vase is pink i just think that look much better so yeah just come outside for the night take your time get your light I'm back now. Um, I filled this up with water, and I'm about to put this in there. It's on the dotted line. I've been flying out of town for some peace of mind. It's like always, they just want a piece of mind. I've been focused on the future, never on right now. What I'm sipping, I can boot you either pink or brown. I'm the one that introduced you to the you right now. Oh my God. That be bad. Well, all right. Trying to fight. In the night. Come alive. Ain't it sneak. Ain't it. Ain't it. Ain't it. Ain't it. I'm kind of tired, so I'm gonna settle down and watch The Little Mermaid. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.